Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to install a radiator on a 2003 Subaru WRX. Um, if you want to learn how to do the, the coolant part, um, I have an annotation at the top, but this, in, this tutorial is just going to be how to actually take the radiator out and reinstall a new one. The first thing you want to do is take off the mounts that actually hold the radiator to the frame. There's the first one, and then take the second one off. It's just one screw. And then take them off. Okay, and take off the hose to the upper radiator. Alright, take that off. And then, of course, take your side off that connects to the engine. And then take off these two small hoses that are on the passenger side of the radiator. All right, and then take off the hose on the bottom. This is the lower radiator hose is on the driver's side. And this on the engine, connected to the engine. And then take off the uh, the electrical clip that's this is also under the engine driver side so take that plug out and here's the passenger side plug so you need to take that out too that's from the top of the car okay and then you can actually remove the radiator so uh, just be careful and basically just need to wiggle it like straight out okay so pull it out and then see you want to swap your your fans over to your new radiator so I think there's about three bolts on each fan. Let's take those off. And then of course take off the bolts of the, the reservoir as well. Swap that over. Okay, and so this is the new radiator, so we're putting everything back together. And I'd recommend putting the lower radiator hose on the radiator before you put it in the into the engine bay. It's easier. Okay, and then after you do that, drop the new radiator into the correct spot. Make sure that the uh, the feet are where they're supposed to be on the mounts on the bottom. So you need to make sure those are in there correctly. Okay, and then put the plug back in. This is the driver side plug from the bottom. Okay, and then the passenger side plug from the top. Okay, and then uh, this is the lower radiator hose looking from the top. So put that back to where it connects the engine uh, where the thermostat is, and then put your mounts back on. All right, and then put two little hoses back on the passenger side. Second one. And then put the upper radiator hose back on. So this is the the side connecting to the engine and then the side connecting to the radiator. So uh, that's basically it. Hope that helped you. Um, again, check the annotation if you want to learn how to do the coolant.